I never knew love was real Till you walked into my life All of my fantasies Came true before my eyes And just the thought of you Puts a smile upon my face My life is not changed Everything just falls in place It's been a long time since I felt real happiness So I thank you baby cause I feel true Life be so real I can't explain how I feel But one thing is for sure Each day I love you more My baby, can't you see You complete me Every day and night I think of you Thank the good Lord that you, my boo From the highest mountain To the deepest sea This love we share is infinity Everything you do I appreciate You're truly my soulmate And I love you so dearly It's been a long time since I felt real happiness So I thank you Cause I feel truly blessed You must be an angel sent from above The true definition of love Does love be so real? I can't explain how I feel. But what is for sure? How in the line? Oluwati me me yafu ma after my life. Kamo miguel so gary mo pas pasi mai. I would like to introduce Anna Veronica Burke and Charlie Salazar.
เดี๋ยวเอาก้าวลงให้อะไรแอลเลนยาอุนิสุเ
Ayo, nampak hero ini kata pas pasi mai. Ivi ni mui kau ini bawa apa kira kau kau rasa bawa Eric Lord. Eric kita apa kita melawan orang lain. Next, I'd like to introduce a cousin of the bride, Miss Sabrina Fafanua and Matthew Massif. Please put your hands together and let's bring over our maid of honor with the banya, Miss Paola Kifana Baya and Alex Kaiser. I'd like to bring all our ring bearers to us to our flower girls. Oh, pas pasir mai. Kita ada ko high sipe baya. Kita berhenti fokus. Kegira ni nama. Pokas pasi Maya, hai si berat. Kalau Maya, kita hai tahu tu menyalah tahu hai mana dia lagi. Music, kalau kamu. And the rest of the flower girls may I introduce Kira and Diana Sulasura. So I give it to our girls. And I guess we do have an announcement. It's just living. Whatever goes around, let's give them a round of applause. Are we ready with our chest? Tadaki. Tai Mahapasa. Ladies and gentlemen, please can you all rise. Let's welcome our newly well. Mr. and Mrs. Domasi and Hey Mama. Kaiser. 
ไปที่ชายคนสูงกว่าแต่เดี๋ยวผู้ว่าตาตาเราตัวเหมือนตาคนว่าเราต้องทำอย่างนี้ in this very special moment I like to associate my celebration to Her Majesty Queen Anastasia, Your Royal Highness Princess Latufuibeka, Lord Vaya, and all our distinguished guests today, Minister of the Church, also my utmost respect to acknowledge. I will nearly work half of the day. Please put your hands together and give it to Thomas and Eve. Hey, Mama. Hi, sir. Also, I'd like to acknowledge, acknowledge the parent. Mr. and Mrs. Kaiser, please can you rise? So, as to Larry and Aliria, my boy, Moki Paspasi, my mother. Ladies and gentlemen, today Thomas and Heiman has invited us to witness and celebrate the uniting in marriage. And I'm sure it's a special gift for all of us and should be entrusted within us. The Taukamata, Fagafia, Toyria Taritario, if you have any key more, but of Hoka Fano too. To Guanaya, Kiki Kui Koene, a Heimana. Our welcome speech will be done by Tuihova Tiriti. Takabu, my Lolo, you can go to Papara, pay me new one. Take out my wife, they look for Papara, go on now. Ladies and gentlemen, it is a great honor and privilege to have this opportunity to acknowledge with appreciation for all of you people who cannot speak Tongan. I'm sorry my English is broken, my grammar is broken, my pronunciation is broken, and you say, what the heck is this guy here standing in front of us and speak English? Because Luciana and Sarah, my mama, pushed me to have a speech today, but I told them I can't speak English. I was in school before the English came to Tom. <laughs> Therefore, ladies and gentlemen, from Thomas family, I really like to appreciate your working hard, your dedication, your support for make this marriage is forever. Taimana, talk to your husband. Go in the loud all as he's rising. Go in the tawagi or magic. The moho no wine. Okay, guys, go wine. Of course, I mean, was go some sort of fire, the wine, the wine, but you can call for more water. Night guys, what can you feel here? Go to the time I get to the Korea, I go to the land, go to the house, and to push them to the Korea. They will never go to the house. So, for those of you who wonder what our old uncle has been talking about, he said he loves you all. <laughs> but Lord, the whole Fernando, the boy who was Lord of the Motherfucker, and for two or three days, I'm going to be a man who's going to be a man who's going to be a man. Amor Moreira, o Amai, em que te viva perro o fare a uma coisa toda, o fare o fare de rico, e time em muita gente.
parents, they like to come over. They all come from the beautiful island of Samoa. For all the Taiwans and the Polynesian, we all know what a wedding party is. We do all kinds of celebration, all kinds of presentation. But this time, I'd like to honor Heimana, bringing over her friends to perform a special Samoan number. Oh, Pussy Pussy Mai, the Masina Wolfa Lau. So the two of them, Rita Rita, help us yourself and Faith in the Alka Calatelli. All the way from Samo, please give it up to our sisters here, our Pokemon. Hello. So, these are the Samoans from the University of Oregon together with Kaibana.
Ladies and gentlemen, we'd like to bring over mostly the cultural part of our program today. But before that, before we go into the cake ceremony, please, ladies and gentlemen, stop, drop your folks in your night. Let's boogie. Give it up to our DJ. If you two can come forth to your wedding cake to the front, please. Call your together, Thomas, Mogli Mana, the Bogata, my Moa. You are walking in, but I hope one day I will go young. Thomas and Mana and 
sure there's a knife right there in front of you. Debbie.
like to just turn over to the bright sister. Well, all I found out and the best man to come forward and take over that program. Okay, first bus make the fun.
asking how many, how many uh, bridesmaids and, and groomsmen you guys chose to have at your wedding. Uh, so anyway, let me, let me tell you guys about my relationship with Thomas. We met in the 90s. Um, you know, uh, the age of the age of you know N64, the Walkman, Blockbuster. But Thomas was a uh, Thomas was an alpha dog and older brother. Thomas always had a scowl on his face. Um, wore T-shirts, four sizes too big. Um, backwards hat. Thomas tormented me growing up. Uh, usually I'd, I'd start wailing uh, after Thomas beat me up. Catherine would start screaming. He'd stop and then Catherine would yell at him. Uh, despite this, I, I've always looked up a lot to my older brother Thomas. In middle school, Thomas, Thomas put all his energy and efforts into sports. Uh, he began to excel in football, especially academics. Um, and he was a standout player. By high school, he was Thomas was built like Thomas was built like a child bodybuilder. In stark contrast to me, who was uh, fat until seventh grade, and then I got super lanky and then uh, and, and then super awkward. Um, Thomas' trophy collection was always towered over my place ribbon collection. But it's my life. Um, Despite the fact that Thomas tortured all his family and siblings growing up, uh, Thomas was always the star of the family. Kathy would always introduce the family like this. Kathy would go, this is Thomas, he has a size 15 shoe. <laughs> and then here are the other five losers. Um, no, I'm just kidding, but uh, obviously nobody cared about this size shoe. My high school became it became uh, evident that Thomas was going to play D1 football and the fact that he was a uh, was an A student and he was obviously going to wind up at Stanford. He was, he was a perfect fit. And uh, Thomas' accomplishments were always undeniable. And the bar was set extremely high growing up. And uh, I'd be lying if I said it was, it, was, uh, it was easy growing up behind Thomas. And uh, it, it wasn't. But, um, and on the, on the field or in the classroom, but we're all incredibly proud of Thomas. Thomas has played D1 football. Thomas has attended a prestigious university. He's made a lot of great friends. Um, and uh, after graduation, Thomas, attend, Thomas continued to kill it. Thomas went in the NFL, received his MBA, bought and sold properties, uh, created and sold a company. And, uh, and Thomas bought a farm for he and Mama to live in when they moved to Pittsburgh. <laughs> the entire family is incredibly proud of Thomas um, and everything he's accomplished in 30 years. And the best quality about Thomas is the fact that you'll never hear him speak about everything he's accomplished in 30 years. Thomas is one of the most modest people you'll ever meet. And that's because of the fact that he's crowned in his faith with Jesus Christ. And, uh, <laughs> Workers I know, and uh, he doesn't ask for help, he's brutally honest. He sets sight on something and he, uh, he makes it happen. And uh, Thomas has a lot to be proud of, but I know he's most proud of the fact that he's married to um, his best friend. Mana, I'll never forget when Thomas came back and missed the meeting uh, chair about her missing meeting in down in uh, Tonga. He, he looked at me and he said, hey, I, uh, I met the woman I'm going to marry, and he didn't smile at me, he didn't joke around, he, he knew I met the woman I was, you know, Thomas was going to marry, and uh, he was going to do everything in his power to make his wife, and he did that. Mama, ever since we met you, we've all known you were a keeper. Um, you're beautiful inside and out, kind, compassionate, genuine, and smart. Um, I couldn't ask for a better sister-in-law. Thomas and Mama, I'm honored to be standing here today. I couldn't be happier for the two of you. I wish you guys the best. And I love you both very much. We can all raise a glass to Thomas and Mama.
everybody put your hands together for the blood and the groom. It is now time for the first dance. Yeah. 
Kaya mga fan. Pabore po niya. Upo niya, ito kung may po ay tama ako na kasi ito kung may marumaro kaya pa nga i-aitin. Sa pwede tayo ko ay niya. Ito nga ako po ato, ay kula. Kasi ito ay mga kaya nga may mapangang. Upo niya ito kaya kula mo ana ko mo tayo niya.
Bukan apa yang buat kata aku Buat kata aku tengah hafif tu ben Itu boleh ya lah tengah si Nak buat itu ke boleh ya Tak apa kalah Kebuan yang buat ni Singan Tua Fahfin ya Larry Kau pernah hokot ya Kau kalah bapa ini Our next entertainment will be the form by the bride dad's family. And I'd like to call upon Larry and the sisters. Oh 
Vai fare una malattia con i E tu qua anche io che Tomasi per la mia mano. Tomasi per la mia mano. Ok, pass pass in my I thought we can make Mario a holy. Thank you very much. And now for all of my non-Tongan speaking guests, our non-Tongan speaking guests, um, I would first like to extend our 
appreciate you and thanks to Her Majesty Queen Anas Babu and Her Royal Highness Princess Mataho for being humble enough to be present at such a momentous life occasion for both of us. It has been such an extreme blessing and an honor, I say confidently for both Thomas and me, in having both of you here tonight. And I want all of my wonderful in-laws and my non, our non-Tongan speaking guests to understand the humility and the grace that it takes for attendance to such a small occasion. So we thank you both. And I would also like to extend our cultural courtesy um, and respect to our distinguished guests, including Lord Vaya, Lady Siatki Moana Vaya, as well as Lady Fafanua. Um, and the rest of the speech, Tulo, 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 I'm going to say from my heart. I would just like to thank every single person in this room for being here with us tonight, first and foremost. And at the beginning of all of this, Thomas and I looked at each other and we go, how are we gonna make this happen? And somehow we made it happen. And for all of the challenges, For all of the challenges and, and difficulties and obstacles that we came, we faced along the way of planning all of this and organizing it um, with respect to Her Majesty and Her Royal Highness, we managed to find a way, and again, with the help and thanks to um, our families and our parents, love always finds a way. And we are very blessed, um, although it's a large responsibility to have so many people that love you. I look at him and I go, we're lucky this many people care about us. And so it's, uh, it's been an incredible blessing on behalf of both of us to have everyone here. I wish I could name every single person in this room, but we thank you very much from the bottom of our hearts for being here tonight with us. Now I would like to um, go into my own individual and personal thanks and appreciation to my parents. Alilia and Mary Moimoy. I don't know where they are. If, if they are anywhere, I haven't been able to see them at all. Can they stand real quick? Dad, please stand. With much irritation, <laughs> uh, the two of them have, have guided Thomas, Thomas and I along uh, understanding and better appreciating the obligations, responsibilities, and blessings of my Tongan culture, and always teaching us to give the best, give the best, give the best. Even if it's nothing, you give it. And they, they have really taught us that, and there are never, ever going to be enough words in my heart to thank my parents for the things that they, that they have instilled in me. And in addition to that, this wedding would not be possible without them, so again, second thanks. 
But uh, next to that, I would also like to extend a lovely appreciation to Toda Pile Ota. I don't know where she is either, but if she could stand as well. Never mind, she's not standing, but. She also has played a key, key role in, in my life. And all together, there are so many people who have made the team that is my family. And uh, it's been a ride, it's been a wild journey, and here I am today, and I would be nothing without these people. A very special note of appreciation and thanks to my grandmother, Anna Ma'afu. Ma'afu. who is, excuse my language, your majesty and your highness, one hell of a woman. <laughs> and uh, she's really instilled strength and, and a, lot of, uh, a lot of confidence and joy in me. And I would also just, just like to give a very quick note of appreciation and thanks to um, my grandmother, Baroness Tutu Kubaya, who is not able to be here with us today physically, but I know for a fact when I spoke with her on the phone last that she is definitely here with us spiritually. And I look in this, I look around this room and I. Live is there. I just, I can't quite wrap my soul and my mind around it. It is. It, I'm overwhelmed, and I know Thomas is too. Just completely overwhelmed with, with the love. And the very last note of appreciation and thanks that I would like to give is to um, Thomas's family, both the Kaisers and the Werners. Boy. I was like, how are our families going to combine? How are they going to love it? How are they going to hate it? And we, we threw them in the mix, and they just rolled with it. And we love them for that. And they have always, always treated and loved me like their own. And I appreciate and, and love this family for that. So we thank you. Very extremely last conclusive uh, note of thanks is to our bridal party, who has not gotten enough recognition tonight. Um, our bridesmaids, as well as our groomsmen, for continuing to put up with our attitudes, really mostly my attitude. I turned into bridezilla, told myself I never would, but thank you for continuing to ride along with us in this crazy journey of planning this wedding. And, um, yeah, there aren't enough words of thanks. We love and appreciate all of you. And we thank you, thank you, thank you for your role in our lives and making us the people we are. So I'm glad. At risk of sounding redundant, I would like to do a lot of thank yous that may have been covered but nonetheless deserve one, two, however many acknowledgements. And so I would like to begin with Her Majesty. We thank you for coming. I know how blessed and fortunate Mana feels to receive such love from you. And she's so grateful for the relationship. And to Her Highness, I feel like we've got some great quality time over the past few years. I feel very fortunate. And the relationship that I've seen with you and Mona means so much to her. And we thank you both for attending. It's an honor. And uh, it really is, it really epitomizes that family is everything and how much family means to both of us, and we thank you. I would like to thank Mana's parents, both sets, Lord Vaya, Lady Siatu. Thank you for traveling halfway across the country.
and Larry and Leon. Thank you. Wanna? Thank you for many things, but I think it would, as we stand here today, be most relevant that you get your blessing. <laughs> what I wanted to propose, and I thank you for the belief that I could take care of Mona and treat her right and honor the culture. Thank you. I love you too. Um, I know how important and beneficial you've always been with Mama. And Mama's an incredible woman. And she has so many people. I have so many people to thank for who she is today. And so with with that acknowledgement, I'd like to move on to my family and say thank you to both sets of my parents. So, I'll start with my mom and Walt. Stand up. steadfast in their love and support and have been an inspiration to both Mama and myself for uh, the type of relationship that we would seek to build. And, um, you know, I don't even think it was the most overt effort. They just set good examples for us and are always there. And um, I really appreciate you. We really appreciate you. To my dad and Betty, please stand up for anyone Thank you for your love and support. You have both also inspired us and you have you have come through and we have been able to count on you at various times when uh, you know it's just been when it's been tough and, and we thank you both and um, we're very grateful I'd like to thank my grandmother who was in attendance Grandma, I love you. I've said, I've said, I think a few times, you're not the most talkative person, but when you speak, it's pure gold. It's uh, you, you love all of us grandkids unconditionally, and, and you mean so much to us, and the fact that you can come across the country for this wedding is amazing. Yeah. All right, I promise I'm gonna take too much longer. I wanted to say a quick thank you to my many siblings, Mana siblings, the bridal party, and all of our friends and family who have loved and supported us and continue to do so. Uh, you know, today feels just too many blessings to count, and I just wanted to share a quick verse with you that I thought was, that kind of epitomized where Mana and I find ourselves just overwhelmed with such love and abundance. And it's Romans 8.28. <clears throat> and we know that God causes everything to work together for the good of those who love God 
and are called according to his purpose for them. You know, we fail all the time to discern God's will, have the courage and fortitude to live his will, but when we have him in our heart, we pray to him, and when we give our best every day, things fall into place. Mano and I are so lucky to have found each other and to, to have now married. And the blessings keep coming. We thank you all and uh, we love all of you. Thank you very much for talking about saying, hey, mama. Unga ga pea mo ta ga po. Tuku ko e tau fatka ka to o korea ni ke a kau kau loka. Ladies and gentlemen, we're coming to the end, the conclusion of this party with Lord Maya giving us a closing speech. But before that, Lord Maya wants a fast beat song so he can make his way to the microphone. Die, my boy, boss.
and it's a commandant and we have the guys and family in the back here. This is our commandant, all of us. And we have the members of the hatchet. Your Majesty, Princess Makao, Tahaku, Tahuaha, Senate. Ovanua, Ilake Papuruan, Ochela Se, Ochela. Senyore, Sela Tukia, Mama Paina, Kakap, Mama, Kato Kim Kama, my Pehifuga, your father Nathan, and my father Eskivia. Kafika was here, Kamo, Kafika for all, Kafika for the war. Kau mau kai kai mau ไม่ได้เออมาดูเอาเนี่ยโอ้ใครใส่ไปที่ตัวไว้เอาไว้ไอ้โอ้ใครใส่เอาเออเป็นคนหนุ่มไงเอามาตัวไว้ไอ้
Arrête de m'en croire à toi, tu gagnes. Mon premier match de mon calamour. Un mot pour ma oué, abdoumé. Un mot pour ta oué, abdoumé. Un mot pour ta oué, abdoumé. Come to me. We will go for it and dance on it and we can't get the last time tonight. Let's go for it. But what do you want with the time? Go over to the end of it. Go ahead, Jack.
Bagi kei o o kutua pea e kei a marangalangi Katu pea o tua ke mau fia fia He mahi no te mau tolu O kuke tataki A e whalonganga mau fai O e kere se ae kusi su kwaes Mua whalahi a tua ke tamai Feo ke mua lau maari e mau yoni Ke e te mau tolu kutua pea ia Kota e nata Amen